Somehow, we had managed to survive and make it back to the hideout. Once there, Tennessee gave us the lowdown, how he'd been planning the bank heist that should have gone down in Cooper lore as his masterpiece, only to have a mysterious new sheriff arrest him before he even reached the bank. Curiously, the robbery still occurred and all the bank's gold was stolen. Tennessee was charged even though he was already in prison and the gold was never recovered. Of course, he had a strong suspicion it was Sheriff Toothpick himself who had stolen the gold and framed him. And after a little research, there was no doubt he was right. Bentley was able to uncover plenty of information about the sheriff. Although he changed his appearance somewhat, Toothpick was a two-bit gangster from present-day Eastern Europe. According to his file, he'd grown up loving two things, gold and cowboy movies. He eventually specialized in gold robberies, and for a while had masterminded some of the largest scores around the world. Then he abruptly vanished. The word was he had always thought of himself as a gunslinger, and it looked like he had found a way to make that a reality. The guy was a real loose cannon. We'd have to watch our backs if we were gonna steal back the missing gold and restore Tennessee Kid Cooper's reputation as the greatest outlaw of the Old West. Okay, the first order of business is getting Tennessee his guns back. Well, it's just the one gun now. I upgraded. But yeah, I need my shooting iron back. Agreed. Uh, according to my sources, Toothpick closed this old gold mine several months ago, declaring it unsafe. In fact, he's converted it to a storage facility for his stolen goods, including Tennessee's gun. We'll need to take measures with this job so as not to arouse suspicion. So, employing a masterful disguise, I'll tail Toothpick to the mine's entrance and mark it with a homing beacon. Murray, you'll then use the beacon to find your way there. Toothpick's sure to have secured the entrance, so we'll need your formidable skills to get it open. Then, once we have access, Tennessee can get in and get his gun back. Let's get to work. Okay, I need to keep up with this guy. I better stay close, but out of direct sight. Hmm, let's see. Better restock the saloon soon. I work up powerful thirst counting up all that gold. <laughs> Lead on, Toothpick! <laughs> Just because I'm splitting the gold with the boss, doesn't mean I've got to split it right down the middle. <laughs> hmm, let's see. Better restock the saloon soon. I work up powerful thirst counting up all that gold. <laughs> oh, this town is looking like real ramshackle. Maybe I just blow it up when I'm done here. <laughs> On second thought, I should have gone with a sombrero. <laughs> oh, I bet them Cooper cowards ran a yellow streak right out of town. To them. 
Corns are really hurting. Uh, I need some new boots. I'm on him like encryption on a data stream. And nobody's going to find this entrance. To take a little look at my gold. <laughs> All right, time to open up a can of hack. Oh, scorpions! Guys, help! Yeehaw! The cavalry's are coming. Don't worry, Bentley. I got the bug spray right here. I need more clock speed! Better use the speeder code! Time for that upgrade slot! Speeder code engaged, updating physics code module, and voila! Elastic projectiles! Perfect for shooting around corners! I can't take this security on directly. It's time to bounce some shots around the corner. on that switch. If I press and hold the R2 button while moving the ship, I can close a damaging laser loop around a target. Looks like I can only grab the data key with my shell code. Yes, a data key! Like I should just go with the electron flow in this thing. Systems are go. I bet a laser loop around multiple switches would do the trick. Beat the fire wall. to do the trick. Password accepted. Danger. Oh boy, 
Looks like they brought out the big guns. I better tackle this big guy piece by piece. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. Bingo! This data key should fit that lock. Can use this data key to disable that firewall. The gate is open. Time to dock the ship. Security, thy game is hacked. Awesome, Murray! Okay, Tennessee, you're up. Shoot! I'll be in and out quicker than a hyperactive rattlesnake. Hey, guys! This door's kinda... Uh, heavy. to get reacquainted. Let's see. First, I need to press and hold the L1 button to enter targeting mode. Once in targeting mode, I can use the right stick to place the cursor over a target. Then I just press the R1 button to pull the trigger. Yes, sir. It's all coming back to me. Guess I better make tracks before old Toothpick finds out. I wonder what old Toothpick is cooking up in here. What in tarnation? old door is gonna require my crack shot technique. First, I press and hold the R2 button to enter crack shot mode. Next, I can use the right stick to move the cursor and draw a bead on multiple targets. Then I just release the R2 button to blast them. I can only use crack shot when my Cooper focus is full. This one's tricky. I need to shoot all those locks at the same time. Jumping to 
to a different rail using the X button. Let us see, I'm detecting a strong electric current on those rails. Keep your eyes open. Stop that electricity, Tennessee! This is more fun than square dancing with a donkey! Yep, I need to keep pushing! You couldn't catch me with a bolt of lightning! Woo-wee! Full steam ahead! Ain't no better way to get around! You hombres don't know when to quit! even fair for you. Y'all should have cleared out when you had the chance. I don't know what's worse, the spiders or the scorpions. Day. You boys should have just get daddled. to quit.